what's up, what's up, what's up, ladies and gents, I'm back again with another one, let's get ready to rumble, <laughs> alright guys, this time it's going to be the Turtle Wax Ice Ceiling Shine versus the Meguiar's Gold Class Carnival Plus Quick Wax, I am just playing around with these products, you know, uh, both on retail around... Eight to nine bucks. Um, Turtle Wax went up. I, I mean, I don't even know if you can get Turtle Wax Ice Sun and Shine out of Walmart now, you know. Uh, some people say it ain't. I know it ain't in my Walmart now, guys. I don't know about y'all. Y'all comment below if y'all still can get this out of y'all Walmart. Because I just haven't seen it in mines no more. So, um, y'all know you can get the Meguiar's Gold Class out of there for about $8. They run close to about the same price. Except for uh, both of them 16 ounces, you know, so they about the same price anyway. So, uh, no further ado, man. Let's jump into it, man. Uh, we're going to start off with the Meguiar's Gold Class Quick Wax. Spritz it on the applicator pad that you see right there. And just spread it on the pan. We're making it easy. Okay. We making it easy for you guys, man. All right, let's hit it with another one. Spritz that right to the panel. Kind of let it penetrate down in the, on the panel a little bit. Then we're going to spread it with the applicator. Okay. Okay, so I want to let you guys know I got several applicators now. We ain't using the same applicators. So I want to let y'all know that. Cause somebody said, oh man, you the same applicator? No, nah, they ain't the same applicators, man. As you can see, we got several applicators. Plenty of applicators. Got about 15 or 20 of those things. All right, so now let's buff them off. Here we go. Once you apply with the applicator, guys, you just take your microfiber cloth and just... Buff off the SS. That's all you got to do. No big deal. Dip that rag. And continue the buffing process. Alright. It's a done deal here. It's all the way live. It's off. Alright. So now let's move over here. To the. Um, Turtle Wax Ice Ceiling Shine. Alright. Let's spritz them down. Alright. Doesn't take that much. Spread it to the panel. Okay. That's the first coat. Let's hit him again. I'm going to shoot it right on the panel this time. Because I did that that way. Alright, put it around the panel. Okay, here we go. Now, remember, like I just said, now, both of these products can be found at Walmart. Now, was anyway. I know the Gold Class, the Meguiar's Gold Class can be found there right now. Turtle Wax, Ice, Sun, and Shine is getting kind of stink there. I ain't seen it at my Walmart, but you could. Now, you might can look other places and find it. I'm not sure. I know you can get it on Amazon. But normally, if you guys can find it at y'all Walmart... Um, you should be able to get it. Both of them run about the same price, around about nine dollars, eight to nine bucks anyway. All right, so let's buff this back off. It's the second and final coat of the Turtle Wax Ice Ceiling Shine, man. Okay, that's some slick stuff, man. That Turtle Wax Ice, flip that rag over. It's some really slick stuff, man. I tell you. Alright, so let's compare the shine and dip and the glow. Here's the gold class side right here. Here's the turtle wax ice ceiling shine, man. Alright, you see the shine and the glow and the dip between these two products? But I told you guys, like I always say, 
The shine ain't what's important. How it's going to be that water is what's going to protect your car. All right, so uh, let's get into it. We're going to start off with the water behavior test. We'll start off with the Meguiar's Gold Class Quick Wax. Here we go. Oh, man. Very nice beating technology there. Oh, yeah. See that? Oh, man. Look at those bees, man. It's impressive. You can tell them detailers didn't do this, did it? All right, it's Mose over here. To the turtle wax ice ceiling shine. Let's hit it. All right, now, like I always tell you guys, it doesn't take a whole lot of water to test these products. Just want to see the beating action of it. Here's the turtle wax ice ceiling shine. Okay. Here's the Meguiar's Quick Wax Gold Class. Okay. Alright, here's the Turtle Wax Ice Ceiling Shine. Okay. Now, from these two, I can say uh, the beating action is about the same. From these two products, um, one is good as the other. Now, I ain't gonna tell you one is gonna last. I'm pretty sure that the Turtle Wax Ice Ceiling Shine will last longer, but that Meguiar's can hang close. Uh, we got to go and try the Ultimate next, the Ultimate Quick Wax. Now, I would say they, these about a tie for us water behavior. Now, like I said, don't get me wrong, I'm pretty sure Turtle Wax Ice Ceiling Shine. Will last longer because it's a hybrid sealant. But I'm pretty sure both of them will give you at least two to three months. Uh, even the Meguiar's Gold Class will probably last you at least two months, man. Uh, it's a pretty good hydrophobic stuff as well, you know. And like I said, they both are 16 ounces and they both run about the same price. See, I keep it real with you guys. Now, I'm pretty sure Turtle Wax is going to give you, it may last three to four, where Gold Class might last two to two and a half, you know. But, you know, for for the price, I mean, you can just reapply both of them, you know, if need to be. Uh, that's why I say I never really cared how long they last. I mean, we ain't going to go no two, three months without waxing our car if we're car enthusiasts. No way. You know what I'm saying? They're just keeping it real. We're going to wait three months to wax their car. I ain't. <laughs> so to me, I never care how long it lasts, man. I'm going to get up on my car before two and three months. So it doesn't matter to me how long it lasts. As long as it make my car look like this, give it a nice shine and pop, and it giving me some protection, I'm good, man. So here I'm going to call this a draw, man. Uh, in my opinion, one is just as good as the other. Now, like I said, I don't really care which one lasts the longest. It doesn't matter to me. You know what I'm saying? Because I just reapplied um, every two weeks if I have to. I really don't care. So, anyway, um, hope you guys had fun. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Share my videos with your family and friends. And like I said, in this scenario, one is just as hydrophobic as the other. You know, you can't go wrong with neither product. Just keeping it real. I'm out of here. Peace.